Deputies have just cleared the scene on the west side where a woman shot a suspected burglar at her home. She put a bullet in the young man's head late this morning, leaving him in critical condition tonight. Here's News 13's Maria Medina with new information. And Dick, the crime scene may be gone, but not the shock from people who live in that neighborhood near Golf Course in Paradise. There's still one other suspect on the run tonight. It floors me. It really does. A little more than 10 hours after deputies say a northwest Albuquerque homeowner shot this man, 19-year-old Frank Castillo, as he tried to break into her home. Yeah, I mean, that's terrifying, so. Neighbors who lived next to the crime scene waited for more answers to what exactly happened in their normally quiet neighborhood. We've lived here for 30 years and not had anything like this occur. <laughs> Detectives arrived at the home just before noon, and they say just before the homeowner told them she'd shot Castillo in the head. Investigators say she'd called 911 to tell them someone was trying to break in through the front door. When no one answered, the burglars tried to get in through the back door, and that's when the homeowner, who's in her 50s, shot Castillo. They're trying to figure out if he was in the home at the time. Deputies found him bleeding in the front lawn. It is a very serious injury, and, uh, and again, he's at the hospital in very, very critical condition at this time. Residents say burglars hit their neighborhood before. They pretty much cleaned us out. But it's never ended like this. And this may be a good time for us all to get together and think about a neighborhood watch. And detectives say the suspect they're looking for may have called Castillo's family because some of them showed up at the scene. They're looking for a two-tone dark-colored car. Dick? Okay, Maria, Castillo has a criminal history that includes robbery and aggravated battery. There was also a...